What's good, y'all? Stay today with Cole Orange. Today, we have a very, very special guest in the building. Um, this guy here, man, he is a young Cuse legend, a young Cuse goat. Um, I mean, you've had to been active since I was 13, 14 right, in it. Right, right, right. We got CT Rada in the building. Let's go, let's go, CT. Let's get it. Yeah, how you feeling today? What's your energy? Man, I'm feeling good. I'm on a hundred. Uh huh. Uh huh. Hunt That's right. I just watched you rock your your Street Views Code Orange episode yesterday. Right, right, right. Yeah, we went crazy. We went crazy. It was lit. Little bros pulled up, mm -hmm. locked out for me. I'm saying we're about to go crazy. Yeah, and you back in QC because you don't live here no more, right? Nah, nope. Uh, moved to the A. Moved to the A. I'm saying, yep. I'm just getting adjusted. Just feeling the vibe out. I'm saying, just knowing the area and all that. Yeah. I'm saying. Well, but we're going to get into a little bit of everything today. I mean, every time we speak, I tell you, I think you have a just a great story, a dope story. And I, I think people need to hear that story. Right, right. Um, so let's get into it. Let's start with just growing up in Syracuse. What was that like for you? Mm, so basically, I started off down the way. You know okay. what I'm saying? And for those who don't know, down the way, that's like the south side. Like, uh, that's where my mom side originally from okay so i started off i want to say like what was that Cortland? no matter of fact pleasant oh okay. yeah i started right. off on pleasant okay little jit running around that. yeah that's a little uh, probably like six seven you know what i'm saying boom and then we moved to the east side my mom moved to the east side when i was like nine mm, okay east genesee okay once we moved to east genesee uh where i went to percy Hughes, then once, then I went to Levy. Mm -hmm. know what I'm saying once I start going to Levy, you know. Oh no, I'm tripping. Bitty basketball, bitty basketball. Okay, okay. That's what started this. That's what started me. Know what I'm saying on Crowley on the east side and all okay. that. You know what I'm saying where my pops from and all that. Yeah. So and we went to the same middle school and high school. So like I feel right. like I've seen it from the beginning. Right, almost. right. Right. You did go to Levy with yeah, me. That's a fact. Levy yeah, yeah, Ham, all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a fact. So what got you um started with music? What got you into that? Um I say my mom, she a music head. Okay. My pops, he a music head. What was they bumping when you was young? So you know my mom she was bumping what like that mary okay mary okay, j you know okay. what i'm saying going crazy that real love all right that, right yeah. you know what i'm saying that real soul that real shit mm -hmm. that you know what i'm saying um you know my pops you know he he have he was heavy on the nods heavy on the mob deep you know what i'm saying uh everything 50 mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying so i'm just young so you had a mixture of like the real r&b and the real rap right going on. right yeah. right you know what i'm saying i'm young soaking all that shit up listening to all that like, Oh yeah, that's fire. Right. I would say I always was attracted to music, you know what I'm saying? Since a little nigga. Word. When did you start recording? I wanna say like 07. 07? Yeah, like 07. Yeah. Yep. When like my first song was when Soldier Boy came out that uh Crank That. Yeah, that yeah. Crank That. I did a little remix to that and just went crazy <laughs> for real. Yeah, and, so that had been a while ago. Yeah, that was 07. Yeah. Okay. 07 with my boy Bill. Yeah. My African boy Bill. What was what was life like that, like life back then, like for you? Mm, that's when Mama Love. She was living on, she was living on East Genesee. So, my pops, my pops was actually locked up at that time. Yep, he was he was in the feds at that time. I was probably like thirteen. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Um. You know, going through puberty. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Starting to roam. Coming to your own. Yeah, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Starting to see shit and starting to, like, oh, this is what I like? Okay, the girl's like this? Okay, ah, ah. So I was really, like, learning myself at mm -hmm. that time. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? And just trying new, new new stuff, for real. Okay. Did you, like, grow up playing sports or anything? Was there anything, like, outside of music at all that um, you were doing? Yeah, I, I, was, I was in the sports a little younger. I played basketball. I was doing my thing a little bit. I could... I got a little, I got, I got a little shot. You know what I'm saying? Like I got a little song. Well, football, I started, I fuck with football a little bit, but I was more so of a basketball person though. Okay. For sure. So when did, I guess, when did you start going really heavy with the music? I won't say when I was like 15. Okay. 15, that's when I started going heavy. That's when, 
That's when I linked up with Crumb. Mm -hmm. He brought me to the real studio. Mm -hmm. Now the real studio sound different. I'm like, oh, okay, you know what I'm saying? Bro told me, he told me, he said, look, don't spit no whack shit on my shit. I said, bro, I'm gonna spit some fire. Uh -huh. I promise you. And after that, we locked in, I started going crazy. Right. So yeah, I was like 15. Yep. Right. Mm -hmm. And it's crazy because like when I think about just the beginnings for me with Syracuse artists, Syracuse rappers, like it was that. It was you, it was it was yeah. felony set, it was yeah. Cam, it was y'all back then. Right, you know right, right. Saying? At least when we were young coming up. Um so let's swerve into so back what was it probably like 2010 2011 something like that you dropped you know the the rod of freestyle um the missing you that right, that, right, that right, went right, right. platinum in the town right, double right, platinum right, in the right, town right, missing right, you. right yeah let's talk um, about it the more bars was it more bars more for the bar street? for the streets like what do you remember about just that time that era recording music <sighs> and even just kind of gaining the popularity around the town because like you once when missing you drop it's like all you could hear in, <laughs> right in, right, in school right and all that what do you remember about that time um that time was crazy i ain't gonna lie and it was is not i uh i sit back and i analyze it was beautiful too uh, you was young. You yeah, like, what, like yeah. I was like 15, 16, yeah, you know right. what I'm saying? Like, and then I sit back and think about it, like, dang, he was really doing his thing, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? But um, at that time, I ain't really, I just felt like that's what I was supposed to be doing. I was just doing it. So it didn't really hit me until like, probably when I was in jail, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm thinking about it now, and I was really doing that. But, um, I just, I was just, I was just hungry. Right. You know what I'm saying? I just was wanted my, wanted my story to be be heard. Like anything that I was going through, you know what I'm saying it was real life stories, it's real shit. Like mm -hmm. nigga can't make this up. It ain't no cap. Like you know what I'm saying? Like this is really what's no going cap on. It was no cap. Yeah, like for real. Like it's just real shit, and it was just so raw. And um, I just, I just, I just. I just felt like it was real and it had to be out there. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And the same thing that was about to happen now. They're going to see the real was raw and anything that's going on in my life, like for real. So that's what it is. Yeah. Word. Do you remember anything about recording those songs at the time? Like, do you even, did you even yeah. know? Because I think I looked at it yesterday. Like, I think Missing You has like, almost like mm. 80,000 views. Mm. And you know, a lot of that is just the town. You right, know what I'm right, 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 like, right, 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 right. remember kind of what it felt like at that time? Because yeah. you were a new artist at that time. And right, music out. right, right, right. Um, I actually do remember recording Missing You. Um, I was at my boy, uh, Tall Bucks, uh, rest in peace, uh, Tall Bucks. He had a studio on um, Till right there. And I forgot the engineer name, but uh, it was a white guy, bald head, he had tattoos. Uh, after I recorded the song, he 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 was he, he asked me, he said, how old is you? I said, uh, I'm 16. He said, yo, you really good. Mm -hmm. He said, you 16 years old? I said, yeah, I'm 16. He said, yo, you really good. Keep going, kid. So, um, and at that time, I'm like, Word. Like, I, I, I'm i just doing it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? It was so natural. Like, I'm just doing it. And people, the reaction that I was getting was like, oh, for real? Like, not nah, nah, it was giving me fuel. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, you got to keep going. You have yeah. to keep doing Stop this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, right. you know what I'm saying? Like, you got to keep going, keep going, keep going. And that's basically uh what it was. And, 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 and one thing that I used to do back then, like, you know, in the town, everybody, Back then, it was big and still is. Like, you know, people got beat in their car, loud, mm -hmm. loud beat. So mm -hmm. if you cut through Fayette, you know what I'm saying? You Trump coming through there. Speakers. Yeah, I'm going to flag you down. Like, yo, who's that? Da, 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 da. And then, yo, respectfully, yo, put this hand on. Mm -hmm. I'm going to give you this for That's free. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but put this up in there. You know what I'm saying? So now, I don't know. I don't know I don't know who you is, but I know you got some beat in your car. Right. You put this hand, people going to hear it. You know what I'm saying? So little things like that, being young, already just thinking like market some yeah. type of how i gotta yeah. get it out there like you know what i mean so where that's what i was on going to schools going to different schools and i'm saying giving my cds out mm -hmm. for free you know what i'm saying or I some people buying time, right right you know what i'm saying 
For sure. Right. Just getting out there, bro. Staying hungry. Mm -hmm. Word. Putting yourself out there for sure. I mean, so, you know, eventually, unfortunately, <laughs> you found yourself in a situation where you had to sit down for a little bit. Right, 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 and, right. You know, for me, I think that's where the story gets really interesting. Mm -hmm. um, well, first off, I mean, it, you don't have to say too much if you don't want to, but can you go mm -hmm. into that situation at all as far as how you kind of ended up in that predicament? Mm -hmm. You know, you sat down for seven years. That's a long right, time. Right, 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 right. And basically to sum everything up, it's more so like, you know, when you choose a certain lifestyle, you know what I'm saying? It's certain things that's gonna come with that lifestyle. You know what I'm saying? It's certain decisions that you as a man, you're gonna have to make. You know what I'm saying? If that's what it is, like, you know what I'm saying? If you if you're gonna stand on all 10 of them toes that that man up there gave you, you know what I'm saying? You gotta stand on those. And basically that's what it was. You know, I'm standing on on uh, all ten of mine yeah. at the end of the day when certain situations is gonna occur. You know what I'm saying? I got good energy. I'm a peaceful person. You know what yeah. I'm saying? I promote peace. I want peace. But if a person try to try that or you know what I'm saying, I'm protecting myself to the furthest extent. You know what I'm saying? So that's basically what it was. You know what I'm saying? During that time, you know, that you were, you know, inside what kept you focused? What kept you grounded? Because, you know, again, seven years is a lot of years to kind of be on the inside, knowing that life is kind of moving around mm -hmm. without you on the outside. Mm -hmm. You know, what kind of kept you focused, even in, you know, the dark days, what kind of kept mm -hmm. you just motivated to come out right. strong, you know? Right, right, right. It's crazy because uh, we was just having this conversation. Uh, I'm getting on the phone. You know what I'm saying? I need to know what the fuck going on. <laughs> I need to be lovey-dovey. Right. I need to hear I love you. You know what I'm saying? I need to hear that. Like, and I'm saying, yeah, from everybody. You know what I'm saying? Make my day, take me out of here for these 30 minutes. You know what I'm saying? And of course, visits, you know what I'm saying? But also, you know, like making my music yeah. for sure. You know what I'm saying? Like just being in my own space like i could lock in can't nobody fuck with me like can't nobody say nothing to me no distractions nothing like you know what i mean like yeah. i could really focus like and be up till five o'clock in the morning and shit like that like you know what i'm saying really locking in on on, on, on your creative side mm -hmm. for real also reading too most definitely yeah. gotta feed 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 your mental what you read uh i read a, i read a lot of books so uh let me tell you, number one, the laws of attraction. There's many, a diff mm. many different editions of it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I just would tell people just get into it, like the laws of attraction, just basically going off of the universe and really understanding, yeah, 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 your mind for real and yeah. really being able to manifest things that All you want. All we need is writing a book. Right, right, <laughs> right, 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 you know right, right, right. Uh, Napoleon Hill, Think and Grow Rich. Okay. Uh, you know. So it's really getting your mind right as far right. as just business and. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Music business books. Mm -hmm. um, this is many books. Okay. Uh, what's the other one? I just had thought of another one that I read. Um, I think it was the Atlantic Slave Trade. Oh, okay. Yeah, it was like getting real, real deep oh, into. Yeah, uh, into like Slavery in your history. history. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. I'm big on that too. I'm big on like- Knowing where you come from. Knowing, yeah, and I'm saying knowing that just yeah, how, how how powerful our uh, complexion is. Like, yes. you know what I'm saying? For sure. Nope. So, um, but yeah, I'm uh, just big on knowledge. You know what I'm saying? Being able to learn. Yeah. For sure. Do you feel like you, you changed at all? I mean, of course, you know, you, you're aging, but do you mm -hmm. feel like, like mentally, like what, was there anything you learned or anything you took away from you know, just, you know, almost a decade of having to kind of just sit with yourself. For sure, for sure. I matured most definitely because, you know, some people will go to jail. It's going to make you either more worse, you're going to stay the same, mm -hmm. or, you, or, or, or you're going to grow. You know what I'm saying? And I was one of the ones who grew, most definitely. Mm -hmm. um, uh, so, yeah, I would say I definitely uh, changed, like, my... Perception. Okay. Just the way I the way I look at.
things now. You look at the world, you're all about Yeah, this. like yeah. it's different. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I was tricked. Mm -hmm. Like, you know what I'm saying? But it's just, it's, it's, How old it's were you when straight. you went inside? Uh, I was 19, about to be 20. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So those are like really vital ages as far as just learning, right. like the world, learning yourself. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Mm -hmm. For sure. And that's what I'm saying. Like, even, even then when I came home, or well, been, I've been home with two and a half, three years. Mm -hmm. Like I had to re, I had to learn shit that I was supposed to been learned. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. I had to not really say catch up, just understand this is how these things go. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, and just understanding life. Like, yeah, for the world was, was different. Like, right. I imagine when you, I mean, when you Bro. were in, they probably, it was like iPhone three and then you came out on an iPhone 13. I came like home crazy. to COVID. Bro, I did yeah. seven years and then came home to COVID. That. Like, right. shit was locked down. Like, I gotta have a mask. mask. Yeah, okay. like, I'm like, yo, bro, that was crazy, bro. So you came home right when everything yes. was different for everybody. Right, yeah. exactly. Was that a huge readjustment for you? Uh yeah. yeah, I ain't even gonna I ain't gonna even cap. Yeah, it was different. And I didn't even know it was that real mm -hmm. at the time. And it, it didn't hit me until later on. Right. Like you know what I'm saying? Right. Because in the beginning it's like, okay, like it's kinda like I was hip nah, yeah, I was hypnotized for a minute. You know what I'm saying? I'm just home, just coming home. So it's like I'm just in this state for a second, but as I as time go on, I get to analyze it's like, oh, Nah, are you tripping? Mm -hmm. Like for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? So most definitely. You know what's funny? Cause I'm also thinking about like just the surface silly stuff like yeah. just having to learn like, oh, you can go live on your story on Instagram. Right. Like, I can right, imagine you came right, like, right, what is this? Right. What is going it on? was crazy. It was definitely Definitely, like when I first came home, I posted my first picture and I just seen the hearts and I, before, before I went to jail, it was only like, yeah. like you could only yeah. like stuff. Now it's all these hearts, different, laughs, like, yeah, all the yeah, all these different reactions. <laughs> I'm like, oh shit, like, word, social media definitely was di different. Yeah. They ain't even have Snapchat when, when uh, I went to jail. Yeah. Snapchat didn't even exist. So I had to just figure that shit out too. Everything. For real, yeah, it was, it was, it was, <laughs> it was crazy. You know, I had to get my angles right and shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right, I gotta, right. you know what I'm saying? Got no side, yeah, side like, now, like all crazy. the stuff he wasn't thinking about before. Right, right. Did you come home to anything crazy, like a big party or? Um, uh, I did have a party. I had a, I had a birthday party with um, uh, my sister Taisha and um, and my bro uh, Johnny Dang. Uh, all our birthdays in September, you know I'm a Virgo. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Big Virgo. Yep, Virgo. Right. Um, yeah, that that uh <clears throat> excuse me. Um, when was that? That was twenty twenty or whatever. I turned twenty seven. Okay. Yep, I turned twenty seven. I bought out, you know, all types of bottles and stuff, mm -hmm. throwing up Had to, all that. Right, right. Crying. Right. Yeah. It was it was crying, tears of joy. You get to celebrate it with your people. Right, 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 right. Tears of joy. I mean, so we've already kind of touched on it briefly. So, you know, you get home 2020 mm -hmm. and the first thing that you drop is seven years later. Tell me about kind of that process that the mind state of, you know, just getting back into the flow of making music. Right. And just, you know, how you felt. Cause I mean, that video. Yeah. Like right, I right, could right, feel right. the, like I'm yeah. back. Right, right, know, right. Just from right. watching it. So, right. you know, just tell me about just that whole process getting back into things. Okay. So, um, in jail, I already had like kind of an idea on how like I wanted, wanted anything. You know what I'm saying mm -hmm. to, to 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 be. You know what I'm saying. Uh, I seen it. I already had the 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 the, the vision for it. And um, of course, you know, I linked up with my boy Trick. Shout out Trick. Gotcha. You know what I'm saying. Definitely did his thing on that. Got crazy with that. Um, that's seven years later, and um, it was just a a a, a good feeling for real, for sure. Like that feeling of coming home was different. Like yeah. it just was like. You can see like, how much yeah. everything's changed. Right. You know, everybody turned up for right, it. I right, 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 right. The bros, they popped out for me. Mm -hmm. They did their thing. Shout out to my bros who looked out, and I'm saying definitely made sure I was straight yeah. and, and, and got me on my feet for real. Um, That's good. Right, right, right. 
Uh, it was just a vibe. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Definitely, definitely, looked, definitely like a, a whole time. vibe. Great yeah, time. great just time. Like, everyone's just so excited for you to be back. Right, right, right. Good energy. You know what I'm saying? Blizz, shout out Blizz, man. Free Blizz. Free Blizz. Bro popped out for me. Free Yayo. Free the whole Yayo, squad, yeah. man. Yeah. Um, see, and then you followed it up with the with the, that, the slap, the, the big step. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's that. Until this mm. day, that's yeah, the, I, yeah, every yeah, time, yeah. like every other week, at least lately, I'd go yeah. on whoever's story or your story, and yeah. I keep seeing yeah. people bring that right, song right, back right, up. Right, 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 so, right. So, well, first off, when you recorded that song, did you have a feeling about it? Did you know, like, I, like, you know, seven years later, yeah. it's kind of me getting reintroduced mm-hmm. back mm-hmm. into, mm-hmm. Every, you know, everybody letting y'all right, know, right, some right, people right, might right. not know. Right, right. Y'all, but mm-hmm, like, mm-hmm. when we get back to big step, it's right, like, right, all right, right. Just so you know, yeah, right, I'm exactly, here. Exactly. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. did you know when you was recording that, like, yeah, this got to be something. It I, was, I get a video too. Like, this got to be the one I push. It was. It was actually. Excuse me. It was my little brother. It was my little brother Gelato. Okay. You know what I'm saying, and Gelato was only what 16 at that time. So it was crazy because Gelato was supposed to be on that song. Mm. He was. I ain't gonna lie. He was supposed to be on that song, but a circumstance happened where, bro, he got in trouble. He couldn't. You know what I'm saying? Mm. You know what I'm saying? What is what? What a situation or whatever. He was only what 15, 16. Mm-hmm. So I understood, but I had it. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, yo, bro, we gotta go. He couldn't, he couldn't show up. So I'm like, bro, I gotta do it. Boom, word. And I went crazy when I went to the stool. I went crazy and. I, it was like, it was heat. I knew it was heat. I get the feeling, like, you know what I'm saying? I get the feeling. As soon as I, that beat dropped. Yeah, like, you know what I'm oh, saying? Like, right. it's just hit hard. Like, I'm like, damn. And it was different, too, at the mm-hmm. time. It was, but it was knocking, like, yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying? I had that knock you know that, to it. You know that Jay-Z, that Jay-Z gift when he looking up and he just like, Yeah, just like, right, 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 right. You got a certain yeah, bop to it. That right. shit hit, <laughs> right. Um, so yeah, I knew Big Stepper was crazy. Yeah. Hey, I knew it. I knew Big Stepper was different off the rip. I ain't mm-hmm. gonna front. Word for have, sure. Have you had anybody like major reach out since you've been home at all? Like anyone that's maybe heard that or heard any of your music since you've been um, back and just been like, yo, like it been it been it been like mm, a few like l- little situations. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. nothing too major, you know what I'm saying? It been but little pokes, yeah. You know what I'm saying. People, People showing love, stuff yeah. Like you that. know what I'm saying, yeah. like 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 you little stuff like that. that. Right, right, right. Most definitely, and 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 I feel like at that time I wasn't in the right space. I ain't really understand where I was going like yeah. that, or understand uh, the business how, how how it is. So now that I am, um, we about to get back to it yeah. um, for sure. What prompted you to move out of Syracuse? When did did you move shortly after, like seven years later? Yeah. Big Stepper, so you moved kind of after that. Yes, it was. It was. It was like. Um, so that's like twenty one at that point. Mm-hmm, the beginning of twenty one. Okay. Yeah, the beginning of twenty one. Okay. Um, I actually used to live down south. I lived down south twice before. I lived okay. down south in 09 and two thousand and thirteen as well. Family? Yeah, I got family down there. Okay. Yep. Um, I was, I was. So what basically what what, what prompted me to move um, this time it was like, uh, you know, you gotta stay out of trouble. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? For and sure. and and parole. Because I was on gang parole up here. You know okay. what I'm saying? Okay. And they they gonna be on you. Really you know what I'm saying? They real real mm-hmm. strict. And you know what I'm saying? I'm like, if I go down there. I'm not gonna have to worry about parole like that. Mm-hmm. I'm be able to move a lot more. Less likely to get into right yeah. into in, in a situation. So yeah. I'm like, you know, my odds a better number one just living is better down there. That's the most one. important thing, right? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Coming like, home at the end. Of the day. Exactly, yeah. it's just living. Mm-hmm. So I could be more peaceful down there. And then number two, I could I could network you know what yeah. i'm saying i could my face could it, the, the city is big it's enough people out there yeah. and the right people out there that need to hear me you know oh, what i'm saying in Atlanta. right right you know what i'm saying you want them people there yeah. they out there for sure yeah Word. have you uh, met up with anything anybody down there mm, nah, nah, no no no, 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 no you haven't been down there that long no nah, i've been down there like, uh, two years okay but it's like i'm just now getting comfortable yeah. down there. So now I could move. Mm-hmm. Like now I Everything could situated, house, feed my house family feed. down there. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, so it's it's it's, it's different. Yeah. It's different now down there. Okay. 
for sure. So let's get into just now what you what are you working on now? What are you getting into now? What's you know, what can people look forward to? Because I I okay. know just from talking to you, you're you're so ready to just really yeah, go get yeah. back in it and right, go right, crazy. Right, right, so right, right, right. Just for let sure. people know kind of what you what are you working on exactly? Um, no, I got a lot. I got a lot of a lot of things that I'm working on, a lot of things in motion, but number one for sure, consequences is is, is coming out this month. It's coming out. That's actually the song new that, single, right? yeah, yep. the, the new single that we did for the, that one. Mm -hmm, yeah, that consequences, that right, 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 yeah, 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 it's real lit, real boppity, you know what I'm saying, mm -hmm. uh, drill type of vibe for sure, um, but uh, I'm actually, I'm gonna drop another project, uh, it's gonna be called Poetically Savage, Okay. you know what I'm saying, that's coming out August 12th. Okay. August twelfth okay. is summer. the date. Yep, the end of the summer. Basically. You know what I'm saying? Y'all could definitely expect another project from me. Um, end of the summer. Poetically okay. Savage is coming. Mm -hmm. For sure. Fire. Let's go. <laughs> right, 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 right. I'm excited. Right, you gotta, right. Like, I, I know you can get back out. Yeah. There. Just let remind everybody. Right. In this town and just expand beyond right. that because right. you 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 have a talent. Right. Um, you you mentioned drill. Mm -hmm. Is that the kind of sound you're rocking with right now? Um, you know, it's like I like drill. You know what I'm saying? Me too. <laughs> I, 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 Guilty. I, I, I like drill, but it's like to me, it's they it's so repetitive. Yeah. Like you know what I'm saying? The sound is so repetitive. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can't just go straight drill. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? But I could, you know what I'm saying? I could fuck with it. I'll yeah. jump in the drill lane. Yeah, you know what I'm definitely saying? Definitely versatile. Right, right, right. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate that. You sent me the stuff that you've done back in, you know, in the day. Cause you've done a lot of even like songs for like ladies. Mm. Like you, you're very versatile. So mm. I can mm. I, I'm definitely looking forward mm -hmm. to just a full project of right, just right. showing all of right, everything. Right, you can do. right, 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 right. Most definitely. And that's why that's why I can't I can't go for a drill. A lot of people want me to go for a drill, man, because yeah, I mean, they like me on, on them it. songs, but I couple, can't do it. Right, like, no, right. You gotta kind of like, yeah, it's like in and out of yeah lanes, right, right, saying? right. You know what I'm saying? Like LeBron, LeBron could do a lot. You know what I'm saying? That's why he's LeBron. You get what I mean? Like, like, he play, he play point guard. He could be a center. He could do anything. Yeah, he could do right. a lot. That's why LeBron, <laughs> LeBron. <laughs> right, right. You know what I'm saying? Um, is there? Who are you listening to? Like, who are your favorite artists to listen to? Actually, yeah, yeah. Who are your favorite artists to listen to? My favorite. Mm. I can't really say because I'll be giving people like time. I'll be having like times with different artists. Okay, like, so you go through like phases. Like, yeah, like, yeah, something. like phases and stuff yeah. like that. And I kind of, some, be honest, I really, I really stay away from other people's music. Not too much. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? I can't get too caught up in other people's music too much because it is just it's not like, affecting your sound. Yeah, no, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So I really, but I definitely, as people that's on, like, uh, I'm going with, I'm going with Dirk. He definitely in my playlist, baby. Mm -hmm. Um. They up there, they like. Yeah, right yeah, they, yeah, they at the top. Like, I, I, I respect, I respect they both. They hustle mm -hmm. for sure. And very similar to kind of your your upbringing, you know. Yeah, kind of right, like right. Out of out the mud, mud. Like, right. right. You get what I'm saying? So I, re I respect they come up and they grind. It's more, sense. it's it's more to it than just the song. the songs mm -hmm. with me. You know what I'm saying? I'm looking at everything. Like, you know what I'm saying? So them them two definitely in my in my in my playlist. I could say. So yeah, are you? Do you rock with any of the girls at all? Like Lotto, I Spice, any of them at mm. all? Yeah, it's a, the, the the females doing their thing right now. I ain't gonna lie, they 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 putting on for sure. Mm -hmm. Uh, I like I like Glorilla for oh, sure. Oh yes, she be talking. I like her. You know what I'm saying I like I I, I like her her Just other a side. Different. Yeah, her other side when she dig deep into her herself. I like them them songs yeah. the most. But and, and I like Lotto too. I've been a fan of her music since she was a, a anyway. I respect her pen for sure. Mm -hmm. Word. For sure. Um, before we get out of here, I got a couple quick hits for you. A couple quick questions. Okay. Um, so let's start. First one: Air Forces or Jordans? I'm going with the 
Hmm. I'm saying I'm going. I'm going with all whites, bro. I'm all going whites. Yeah, you I'm can going never go top, wrong with all the all fresh white. pure yeah, whites. Yeah, yeah. I'm going with the all whites. Yeah, I'm going with the, the Air right. Forces. Bet. All right. Next one: weed or alcohol? Right now, in the time of my life, I'm going with weed. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, this one for the town here. Okay. You rock with old carousel, the mall, or the new destiny? Cause it's a difference. I'm going with the old carousel. Yeah, that's I'm going with I the feel. old carousel. Like the new is nice. Yeah, but like, the other one had more soul than it, right. more town soul. Plus, I feel like we was kids. We got into like all the shenanigans yeah, there. Yeah, right, right, like, right, yeah, right, 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 right. It. it ain't the same without like what's that Kahunaville? I think. Yeah, yeah right. Kahunaville was fire. That. Right. Yeah, <laughs> on the, the bottom floor. <laughs> right, right. right. Um. Who is your favorite rapper in Syracuse right now? You can't say yourself. Mm, my favorite rapper in Syracuse mm-hmm. right now? Right now. Mm. I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with Leek. I'm gonna go with Leek in the cut. Leak in the cut, sneak. And and, and, and and that's not even cause 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 I know bro and know what I'm saying like it's that's hard. cause I rock with him yeah. and I seen I, I seen the come up like mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying so as an artist I feel like for sure that's my favorite one right now mm-hmm. fire not a bad pick right 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 Um, this one I'm trying to put you on the spot okay All let's right. go you gotta fuck marry kill lotto ice spice or Coyle Ray. Wait, wait, say that one more time. Gotta I got catch. I got catch the beginning part. Mary, kill. You said I got fuck, Mary, kill. Yep. So you got to pick one to fuck, pick one to marry, pick one oh, to kill. Oh, oh, oh! I got to pick. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. All right, all right. Okay. Bet, bet, bet. Lotto, Ice Spice, Coyle Ray. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> all right. I'm cuffing. I'm cuffing Lotto. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Who the other one again? Wait, you said Ice Spice. Ice Spice and Coil Ray. Oh, I'm fucking Ice Spice. I'm killing Coil Ray. <laughs> yeah, that's a fact. That's a fact. It's like the moment you thought about respectfully like, oh, though. Yeah, yeah. yeah now nah, yeah. they all dope though. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I yeah, fuck yeah. with them though. Michelle, uh-huh. Michelle. Uh, my last one is um, your favorite meal while you was locked up. What's your favorite meal? Mmm, favorite meal when yeah, I was locked favorite up. Favorite meal. I ain't gonna hold you. No, I used to. I was getting crazy okay, up there. So like you was one of those. You had the commissary. Yeah, my getting spoon crazy. go off. Like what I ain't gonna make? cap. What's your, you. What was your best meal? All right, my best meal, bro. I ain't gonna hold. This is what had the dorm going crazy. <laughs> I was making egg rolls, bro, out of tortilla wraps, bro. Wow. I'm telling you, I swear to God, with the with the, I used to get the fresh cabbage. Ooh, okay. I used to get the carrots. Okay. You know what I'm saying? The only thing I have was duck sauce. You That's know what I'm saying? Thing. That was it. But we we had the soy you sauce though. You know what I'm saying? It, That's a fact. They used to. In a microwave? Yeah. Now we, we 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 had a little toaster oven. Okay. Okay. A little toaster oven. Right, you was getting. Yeah, it. we got to get the oil on there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> had the dorm going crazy. Bitch. Yeah, got the dorm going crazy. <laughs> Facts. Whoa, word. They tell you about that. That's, that's fire. That's <laughs> right. crazy. Right. Well, man. I appreciate you sitting down with us. Yeah, most definitely. We, we, Anytime. I think we talked about this almost almost exactly a year ago. We was in New York yeah. City. I we popped out for your show. Right, right, we had right, talked right, about right. it then. Mm-hmm. But we knew like we had to get the timing right. Right, right, and right. We finally got it done. Right, yeah. for sure. I appreciate, I appreciate y'all. you. Yeah, for sure. Right. I, I just want to wish you just so much more success. I hope you keep doing what you're doing. Mm-hmm. I'm ready for you to get back out here, mm-hmm. put your foot on their neck, show them what you can do out here. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Most Forget definitely. just take over, taking over the town. Like, right. It's beyond right, that. You know? Right, right, right. It's beyond that. And it's like, I don't even, the town, it's like, I really did what I had to do yeah. really here. Like, it's, it's, it's time to take what I did and take this shit somewhere mm-hmm. else. Like, you know what I'm saying? And mm-hmm. and like, let's, hey, bye, like, let's work. Like, you know what I'm saying? Put the town on and really get the fuck up out of I'm here. Like, do, for right? real, for real. Yeah. Get it. Any, um like, last words? Let them know where they can find you. Let them know, like, your socials, all that. Yeah, everything on Instagram, TikTok, 
uh, CT underscore Rider. You can find me. Uh, project on the way for sure. Consequences is dropping this month for a fact. CT, let's get it. Project we in here. August. Yeah, project in all, all August, that. man. Let's go. For sure. <clears throat> uh. It's day of today. Another Code Orange interview. We out. Let's get it. CT Rider, let's go.